Yeah, that's right, she's dumping your ass. <laughs> Not the cheater. <laughs> Alright, so he's got to welcome back to my channel. So, today, by the title, we are doing the second episode of Rule Breaker. Guys, the first episode was so juicy. The tea. I'm here for it. I feel like this one's going to be really good. So, I'm excited for it. And it's just, it's going to be good. So, let's jump into the second episode. See what's popping. See what tea is going to happen today. I'm excited. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Episode two, getting into trouble. Oh my God, I want a cookie. Good morning. Morning. That's not a healthy breakfast. I'm sorry. Did I ask for your opinion on my diet? No. Mind your business, okay? No, but it's delicious. Don't need the judgment. Thanks, Easton. Oh, uh, excuse me. Um, what are you doing? Jealous of my cookie? You're not the boss of me. Where's his arm? His arm disappeared. You're not the boss of me. This bitch really took my cookies away and gave me a sandwich instead. You know what? That's rude. Much better. I'm not hungry anymore. All right, suit yourself then. Are you ready to leave? You ruin everyone's morning. Actually, Russ is taking me to school today. Ew, Russ. I definitely don't need a ride from you. I already have a ride. <laughs> I definitely don't need a ride from you. That's what you get for taking my cookies away. I definitely don't need a ride from you. Your boyfriend? Yes. Your dad told me about him. Okay, what's your point? Of course he did. Don't worry, I won't forget about you, babe. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, well this was fun. Not. Anyway, he should be here. Oh, I like the second one. The sass is there. Okay, well this was fun. Not. Bye. Oh, cute outfit, sis. Um, your boyfriend stood you up worse. He stood her up. <laughs> Yikes. Looks like Russ is not reliable at all. Get in the car. No, he'll come. I doubt it. You've been standing here shivering for 15 minutes. Get in the car, please. Okay. I guess there are worse things. You're acting like my dad now. Thanks. Just say thanks, sis. Thanks. Don't say a thing. I haven't said anything, but you're thinking it, okay? What I don't get it, bro, buddy. I said don't say a thing. Um, he's not even looking at the road. Are you trying to kill us? Fine, whatever. So what music do you listen to? We already established this last time. Oh my god. Are we really doing this? I want to get to know you. Well, the feeling's not mutual. Sorry. All right, fine. I listen to a little bit of everything. Any favorites? Rock, pop, hip-hop. You know hip-hop? Battle rap, East Coast hip-hop, alternative, East Coast. I'm mostly into East Coast hip hop. I thought so after you chose it on the radio when I gave you a ride before. What about you? Same as you, a little bit of everything. Thanks for the ride, no problem. You don't have to drive me to school every morning. Yes, I do. Why? I bet I can drive better than you can. I was fine taking the bus. I don't wanna take the bus. I'm perfectly capable of taking care of myself. I can probably drive better than you. I bet I can drive better than you can. I bet you can, but I have orders from your dad. Mm, okay, listen, my dad is really annoying right now. I don't wanna deal with him. He's treating me like a kid. Not my problem. I'll see you tonight, stay out of trouble. Whatever. Oh, not someone hitting Russ with a bagel. Oh, it was her, you know what, queen? Go off, I appreciate you. Babe, did you just throw a bagel at me? Yeah, we should have thrown something else at you, but that's all we had. Yes? Why? You were supposed to pick me up this morning. Was I? I'm sorry, did you pick up your little hooker instead? <laughs> How could you forget you're a jerk? You told me that last night when we talked on the phone. You're a jerk. You're a jerk. You can't seriously expect me to remember every little thing I say to you. Um, I'm sorry. You were supposed to pick me up. You left me stranded. That's not a little thing, Birdie. <laughs> Fine, then don't expect us to date anymore. What? Yeah, that's right. She's dumping your ass. Bye, bitch. Babe, come on. She's probably bluffing. Don't worry. You know how sassy she can be. No, Ryan. She's serious. Listen, no one wants Russ's bushy eyebrows, okay? Of course, you're right. There's no way she'd leave me. I'm way too awesome to be dumped. Trust me, you're not that special. Go hang out with uh, that little girl. Don't remember her name, but go hang out with her. Ew, not him eating the bagel. Are you okay? You look a little pale. Listen, Melissa, mind your business. Don't worry about me. You worry about Russ, okay? I'm fine, just tired. So I was thinking that we could do something tonight at your place. Um, I'm sorry, D who invited you? Cause it wasn't me. Well, I guess I could use some company. I'd rather go home and cry. I'm actually planning on doing homework. We don't want her there, so I'm gonna do homework. I'm actually planning on doing homework. Oh my gosh, me too. Great, do it at your own house. How about we do it together? Don't you have a party or something to go to? Nope, not tonight. Come on, it's been ages since we hung out just the two of us. Yeah, cause you're a snake. 
okay? I don't like to hang out with candy. I guess you're right. So what do you say? Okay, I'm actually kind of excited. Just don't eat the food out of my house. Fine, we'll hang out. Fine, we'll hang out. Yay! It's gonna be so much fun. Yeah, totally. Um, why is she looking at Russ? Why is Russ looking at you like that? He's staring holes in the back of your head because he's psychotic, that's why. We kind of had a fight this morning. Oh no, I think we might be through. He's a total jerk. I think I want to break up with him. I want to break up with him. I think I want to break up with him. What? Skylar and Melissa, keep it down. After school. Wow, I love your room. I know it's awesome. Thank you. It's nothing special. Um, just say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. So what's up with you and Russ? I want to end things with him because he doesn't treat me well. Then you should totally dump his ass. Should we get to work? I don't know why. I just have this feeling that Melissa has a motive behind everything she does. Yeah, okay. I have just the thing to get us in the mood. What? Surprise me. Tell me it's something to kill my bad mood. What are you doing? What is she doing? What are you doing? Is that? I brought wine. Oh my god, this girl. Where did you get that? From my locker. Duh. You bring alcohol to school? Sis, you have a problem. You're crazy. You are now in the top running for my fan of the year. Isn't that a little risky? You're crazy. You're crazy. I know. I'll get some glasses so she can go talk to my man. That's not my man, but is. But I don't like him, but I do like him. No. What do you want? Hi. Uh, I didn't think you answer. You didn't think she'd answer her phone? Are you dumb? Actually, I don't even need the answer for that. I know the answer. You've been avoiding my text all day. Yeah, it's called ignoring you. I wonder why. Come on, you can't mean what you said today. Yes, she can. Can I come over so we can talk? Stop being so clingy. You really hurt me today. I'm busy. I'm busy. Okay. Russ, I'm busy. Come on, babe. I'm in the car right now. I'll be in there in 10. You're not getting in the house. I'm not letting you in. Fine, then I'll find another way. Um, okay, buddy, you need help on so many ways. What's taking Melissa so long? She got caught up with your man. You're so funny, Mr. King. Okay, you know what? The flirting is not happening. What do you think you're doing? Ha am I interrupting Melissa? What's going on? Am I interrupting? Ha, am I interrupting Melissa? What are you doing? Nothing, we were just talking. Right, talking. I thought we were gonna do homework. I'll be there in a minute. Um, I'm sorry, you can get out of my house because this is what we're not gonna do, okay? Actually, I was just on my way out to get the mail. Yeah, bye. What was that? What was what? You were totally hitting on him. You're such a flirt. Why are you really here? Why are you here? Why are you really here? You were totally hitting on him. So, he's hot. Okay, he probably doesn't want you. Is he the reason you wanted to come here and study with me? Of course not. You're overreacting. Kick her out. Tell her to stop hitting on him. Admit that you overreacted. I just don't like her. So kick her out. Tell her to stop hitting on him. Stop hitting on him. I'm not going to kick her out. I'm not that rude, even though I would want to do that. But it's fine. I want you to stop hitting on him. Are you jealous? What was that? Stop trying to dodge the question, Skylar. No, I'm serious. I heard someone scream outside. Wait, I actually hear it too. Ugh, please don't tell me it's Russ. Oh my god, of course it is. Let go of me. Not until you tell me what you were doing. Russ? This is your boyfriend? I really thought he was. Not for long. Some Not for long. Not for long. The idiot was trying to sneak into your room. I just wanted to talk to you. It doesn't look like she wants to talk to you, kid. She can speak for herself. You want to talk to this garbage can? Not really. Fine. You'll regret this. Okay, you know what? Go cry to someone else. Whoa, that was intense. Are you okay, Mr. King? Oh, I'm sorry. Am I? Is he okay? What about me? Sis. I'm fine. Uh he said, I don't care about you. Bye, Melissa. I'm fine, okay? You don't have to look at me like that. Nothing even happened to him. Why are they so worried? I can see that this got to you. Yeah, you just saved my life. No biggie. Okay, if you say so. That this... I'm so confused. I feel like he... What? Okay, I'm just gonna go with the first one because I'm confused. I can see that this got to you. It's nothing. Are you hungry? I'm starving. Good, me too. Maybe you should show me your cooking skills your dad bragged about. Well, I did win some cooking contests. It's my favorite thing, cooking for other people. It's nothing. The second one. It's my favorite thing, cooking for other people. You're amazing. Are you flirting with me, Mr. King? Oh, are we going to cook? No, Melissa, you're gonna go home. I'm a way better cook than Skylar, and this is my cue to kick you out. Actually, Melissa, it's really late on a school night. Your parents will be expecting you. Oh, he's kicking you out. I didn't even have to do it. Fine. Bye, sis. See ya. Never. So what do you say, Skylar? Do you have the perfect recipe for two? Hmm, cooking with Easton will really heat things up. Break out the aprons, call the night. You want me to say no? 
no? I'm gonna say yes. Okay, I definitely have a recipe for two. Cool, so what do you want me to do? What? You're the boss, tell me what to do. Pound the steak, sift the flour, start the vegetables. Yeah, okay. Maybe you can start chopping up vegetables? All right, boss. Ouch, I cut myself. Oh my God. <laughs> oh no, are you okay? I'm fine, it's just a scratch. Then why did you say, ouch, what, what? Let me see, stop being a baby. Oh my God, you're bleeding, let me bandage it for you. You're right, it's just a scratch. Um, let's bandage it for him, cause that's romantic, right? Right? I don't know. OMG, you're bleeding. Let me bandage it for you. Thanks, you're really caring, Skylar. Oh, gosh. <laughs> I never pictured you cooking, but you pictured me? No. Do you want me to take over? No way, I can handle it. Are you sure, princess? I can see that. You're right, a big, strong, toughie like you. I'm glad we're doing this together. No, I can see that. I can see that. Hey, don't mock me. Yeah, okay. Wow, the food was amazing. You did really good. We did. It was mostly you. I probably just slowed you down. Only a little. Hey, you're supposed to say something nice. All right, I'm sorry you didn't slow me down. Are you kidding? I had to baby you the whole way? Well, I guess you did help me up the second one. Oh my God, sarcasm is the way to go. Are you kidding? I had to baby you the whole way. Haha, <laughs> you're a tough boss, Skylar. Maybe we can do it again sometime? Sure, I'll do the dishes. We can do it together. Is this your way of telling me that you like my company? No. Okay, don't look into it. I could get used to having you around, you'll never know. Better than my dad, I guess. Oh my god, why are you dissing your dad like that? <laughs> As I was talking about him. It's fine. You'll never know. Oh, sis is getting her flirt on later that night. Hey, we need to talk about what? Whoa, could you knock? Sorry, but your boyfriend isn't allowed in this house anymore. Oh my god. Your dad would not be cool with creepers like him trying to sneak in all the time. If I ever see him here again, I won't be as gentle as I was today. Fine. Good. Okay, what else? Thanks for protecting me. You can leave now. You can leave now. You can leave now. What's that on the floor? What? Are you drinking wine? Oh my god. Of course she left it. Great. It's not mine. Maybe I am. What are you going to do about it? It's a present for you. <laughs> it's not mine. <laughs> Oh no, that's not mine. Sure. Oh my God, of course he doesn't believe us. Are you gonna tell my dad? No, not if you do something for me. Do what? What do you want me to do? Spit it out. Listen, we both know I don't wanna do whatever it is. Spit it out. I have a date tomorrow. With who? I'm sorry, with who? I'd like you to stay out of the house. Not you kicking me out of my own house. What is this? I'm sorry. Go somewhere else, okay? You're bringing a date over? I already checked with your dad. He's fine with it. And if I'm not, then I guess I have no choice but to tell your dad that his underage daughter is drinking wine alone on a Tuesday night. Kind of depressing if you ask me. Mm, kind of like your life. You're blackmailing me? You're bluffing. Turn on the fake what? Oh no, we are not going to fake cry. Mm. You're blackmailing me? Yeah, I guess I am. So what's it going to be? Fine, fine, fine. I'll stay out of your way. Cool. She'll be here at 3 p.m. tomorrow. Ew, I can't. I don't like him. I'm sorry. No, he needs, he's gotta go. The next day. Good morning. Mm. Mm hmm I'm hungover from all that wine I drank on Tuesday night. Ready for your hot date morning? I'm hungover. <laughs> I'm hungover from all that wine I drank on a Tuesday night. Ha ha, very funny. Emergency, your senior yearbook photo came out today. What? People are gonna be looking at our senior yearbooks for the rest of our lives. OMG, this is a disaster. If you can send me a new pic today, I can pull some strings with yearbook club. Skylar, is everything okay? I need a new picture for my yearbook. I need a pro photographer in the next five minutes. My life is totally over. I look like such an idiot. I need a photographer. I need a pro photographer in the next five minutes. Well, it just so happens that you got a pro photographer right here. It was my college minor and he takes photos. I need a boyfriend like this, but we don't like him yet. But I, I, yeah. We could go down by the river. The light will be perfect right now. Easton is totally saving my life right now. Photo shoot with Easton, keep the design. I am not keeping that picture, uh-uh. Especially for senior year. We're paying the extra money. Yes. Which amazing outfit should I wear for the photo shoot? Cute and pink, let's say. Um, uh, that one looks, yeah, that one's all right. Lily and green, no. Um. Ew, why are these all ugly? Okay, I think we're just gonna do the first one. This place is perfect. You look awesome, those are great colors on you. Um, don't flirt with me. You have a girlfriend date coming tonight, okay? You're gonna make everyone jealous with your new yearbook photo. Make sure you get my good side. What pose should I make? Blow kiss, wing, flip hair, flip hair. Wow, she said, <laughs> I'm a model. <laughs> those pics you sent me were on fire. Who took them? Easton did. Apparently photography was his college minor. Wow, you are so lucky. Um. 
Okay, uh, that's gross. I feel bad for her. <laughs> oh shit. What is it? Don't be- What is it? Behind you. Ew, I'm so- You're such a good kisser. I'll see you later, babe. He already has a girlfriend? Well, well then. Are you kidding me? Girl, don't react. He's not worth it. Oh, hey, Skylar. I didn't see you there. Sure you didn't. So what, you moved on now? You did this on purpose? I know you're just missing me. Oh, you moved on. So what, you moved on now? What, you thought you were special or something? I'll let you in on a little secret. I've been seeing people behind your back ever since we got together. <laughs> not the cheater. <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna throw worse than a bagel at your head next time, okay? Just wait. You're such an ass. Oh, like you're so innocent. I've seen the way you look at your babysitter. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you see me kissing him? Do you see me kissing him? No, okay? You're probably sleeping with him, okay? You know what? Maybe I am. He's amazing and he makes me feel like a woman. Sis, no. No. He's so much bigger than you too. Oh my God, he's kinder than you too. He's so much more accomplished than you too. Oh, I like the last one. He's so much more accomplished than you too. You know, he's a great photographer. Takes pictures of me all the time. Fine, you're just rubbing it in. Buddy, for someone who has a new girlfriend, you look very angry. Girl, that was so intense. You totally got to it. He's looking all flustered right now. Are you really sleeping with your babysitter? His name is Easton and he's not my babysitter. And I just told him not to get back at him. And wouldn't you like to know? Of course not. That is your best friend. We are not lying to her. And of course not. I just wanted him to feel the burn. Well, it seems to be working. Good job. Ladies, class has started. School was dreadful. I tried to ignore rest as much as I could. I'm not even looking forward to going home. Easton's day will be over and I'm not sure I can handle it. This must be the worst day ever. Skylar. Easton, I'm not in the mood. Can we talk later? No, we need to talk now. Fine. What is it? Why have you been telling people at your school that we were sleeping together? Um, how do you know that? First of all. Second of all, it was a joke. Kind of. Oh no. Please don't tell me that's the end. Don't. What? <gasps> Is that the end? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? The fact that that was the ending. What? No. What the hell? Okay. Um, so that was that episode. I can't. Finally, we dumped. <laughs> we dumped Russ. Okay. He was annoying. And yeah, I just. I didn't like him. And he's actually scary. So that's great. Also, Melissa needs to find her own life to bother instead of mine so that's what's gonna happen um but yeah i hope you guys liked it this was a lot of tea there was a lot of drama and i want to see who easton's date is i want to see who his date is because the fact that he's kicking me out of my house that's rude but I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of this series so far. I really like it, so I'm excited. But I love you guys. Don't forget to love yourself. Until next time, I'll see y'all later. Peace out, scouts. Bye.